Thursday the 23rd of December and Missy's come to say hi to you this morning. Charlie's next to me purring away. Hey Charlie, as usual. Somebody's just coming through the cat flap. That's Mikey, he's gone into the bedroom. So how is everyone today? I had another good sleep. Um, feeling better than I was yesterday so that's good. Still tired as always but what's new? <laughs> So, plans for today. Um, I've got to go over to Mum's um, around about lunchtime because we've got um, our Christmas shop coming today. <laughs> Although, unfortunately, um, two items have been substituted, one of which isn't going to be any use because we'd ordered like, a Christmas cake, but they've sent us a brandy soaked Christmas cake and neither of us like brandy, so that's going to have to go back. And then there's four things not available, including me and Mum had both ordered a little box of chocolates for tomorrow night, and they're not there, so never mind. I'm sure we'll have enough goodies to eat over Christmas. So yeah, I've got to go around to Mum's later, and I forgot, I've had my shower and I've put some PJs on, I forgot, of course, can't go around to Mum's in PJs, so never mind, I'll get dressed before I go. Um, and then tonight, fingers crossed, weather permitting, we've got the second annual Christmas Black Rod Lights tour. So, like, um, Natalie and Joanna, my friends, said last night, you know, we'll hopefully meet up about half five today. Um, it's a bit gloomy out there at the moment, but the forecast is meant to be dry for later. So, hopefully we'll be able to do that and I can show you some of the lights around here because everybody does seem to, to go, go out of the way, you know, to make sure that the place is all bright and lit up. The, this village it has a lovely community spirit here and um <laughs> so much better than where i lived before but i mean like obviously i mean i'm, I'm biased because obviously i was born and brought up here but um it's got a lovely community spirit and <clears throat> excuse me people do go to an effort to make the village look look good so i've done my bit i've got me uh <clears throat> excuse me i've got a, a flashing snowflake in my window so <laughs> That's my that's my contribution because obviously there are like elderly people in like in my little cul de sac. So apart from one lady who has like some candle like a candle thing in in a window, uh, nobody else really has any around here. So I'm doing my bit for the community. <laughs> so yeah, so that's it. Well, I've just got a cup of tea brewing. I'll go and get that, and then we'll open uh, the cat's cat vent box and then do some stitching. I think I've not had any breakfast this morning. I'm still my stomach's still a bit. Mm, and I'm meant to be having chippy chips tonight, so <laughs> yeah, so I thought I'll leave breakfast for now and I might just have a potato again later on so it's something plain on my stomach, so yeah, joys. See you in the living room. Here's the cat vent box. Andy's already come in, Mrs. is already here, so let's get the others in. Kitty! Mike is always, always disappointed when he sees it's not food. He's like, oh no, forget that, I'm going. Well, number 10 today is somebody come to see puppy. Yeah, shall we see what we've got today? What I'm going to do after Christmas, I'm going to sort the toys out and put some of them away. Let them use some and then obviously when these are through, they'll have some new ones to go out. Oh look, Christmas, oh they're sparkly. Sparkly stars. Ooh, is that good? Yay, well that's day 10. And now we've just got, if Poppy will get off the box. <laughs> Poppy, can I have the box back? <laughs> we've just got two in there and then they can have the box afterwards as well because that'll smell all nice for them. Yay. Well, a slight pain, change of plans for this afternoon because um, I'm not going up to Mum's for the shopping now because I made a mistake on the order and I accidentally left all the cat food on it that I'd put in to save the spot and there is no way am I going to get all that back on my scooter so I had to ask and I hate asking for help but I had to ask really nicely to my friends Nat and Joe, and they're going to go around with the car and um, pop it down so they, they live right by mum and which is only right by me so it's not far but I don't like asking for help especially when they're always so busy but yeah, it's still raining a bit outside, but the forecast says it should dry up for later, so 
all being well, we'll still be able to go and look at all the Christmas lights. In the meantime, I'm sat here all snug. I have a cuddly purring cat on me and a nice new hot cup of tea. I'm going to carry on stitching and cuddling cats. It's five o'clock and I'm packing up stitching for today because I'm going to go and meet my mum, Marilyn, Natalie and Joanna in half an hour. Um, but I've only done 139 stitches today and it's just pretty much been in that pale pink there. Yeah, so I've just been tired all afternoon and sat doing nothing. Hi, puppy. <laughs> First one I've come to see is one just behind my house. She's really pretty. Hey, my friends, there's Nat and Joe, Hi. and then Marilyn <laughs> and Mum. You all know Mum. <laughs> yeah, I just had to make sure I got Nat and Joe right because with them being twins and they've got hats on, it's a bit more difficult. <laughs> I got them right. Yeah, Nat's got skip in the middle. That's nice, isn't it? I mean, that's an, that's an all year round. That one. We wish you a oh, Merry no. Christmas. <laughs> yeah. Mom, you got a nice voice. I did have, but I, don't, I can't keep a tune now very well. <laughs> Not eating. Well, it's only. Like, I said to Kate, in fact, I only said to her tonight, I'd remind you I was out because she's not in the room. I don't know whether I like the coloured lights or the plain ones. Sometimes I see colour, think, oh, I'd like coloured. These little snowmen are all handmade. They all got names on the hats. Well, really. Little Christmas village, aren't they? Oh, how nice is that? I wonder what happens when it rains on that, though, Kevin. It gets wet. Oh. I used to work with somebody like this. Oh, really? The corner one. Long, long, long. Oh. long before your time. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's not a bad one. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. It's a good one. remembered this one from last year and it was mum's favourite, isn't it mum? Yes, that's another that one, I can't remember where we were, that one had that um, oh, creeping tree, yeah. wherever that was. Yeah. yeah, it's really pretty that, it's very, very simple but effective. Well I can live, I can live oh sorry. Oh you're alright. You can... no? <laughs> now this bungalow here was the very first place I ever lived. My mum and dad lived there after they were married and I was born there and then my grandma and granddad lived in it there for a long, long time. Well, it never looked like that when grandma and granddad lived there. <laughs> no, that never looked like that when Mrs Smith lived there either. Oh. Yeah. 
It's a bit old fashioned looking, yeah. isn't it? Nice though. Nice, it's, it seems a nice fella, yeah. yes he does. Yeah. A bit hard to make out around here, just so there's a lot, a lot of lights around there. The old people's bungalows. It would have been, it would have been a good idea. It looks pretty over there. And then when he actually scatters the food. This is Nat and Joe's bungalow here. Oh, this one's it. This one's just looks lovely. Oh, just that one. Well, right. Yeah. Oh. Obviously bought it. Paid another hundred thousand. Wow. Right, I'm home. <laughs> um, it's just coming up to eight o'clock. I'm leaving my hat on to say goodbye to you tonight because I've I've got real bad hat hair now. <laughs> so, but yeah, um, I'm just gonna get ready for bed basically. So I hope you enjoyed coming on the little lights tour with me. There's m many, 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 many more to see, especially around here. Um, but, um, yeah, I showed, showed you what I could and, well, I just showed you the, the best ones really. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. So I shall see you tomorrow for Christmas Eve. Hope you all have a good day. Bye.